Hey there, this is Dr. Evan Osar with the Institute for Integrative Health and Fitness Education. Welcome to this edition of Integrated Movement Insider. And if you've been following this series, we've been discussing the female core and specifically how we work with our own female clients in our office to train their core, to help our female clients overcome chronic tightness, discomfort, as well as accomplish safely and effectively accomplish their health and fitness goals. And we've been leading up to the release of this brand new resource that we just created specifically for you so that you can have success working with your female clients and really help your female clients address their chronic issues and develop their most optimal and efficient core stabilization strategy. And one of the things I wanna address here in this video to release this product, announce the release of this product, is share with the things, the three major reasons that you want to invest in this program. Number one is at a recent conference a couple weeks ago, somebody asked me what direction I felt the industry was going in. And I said that it's going in one of two directions. One is the right direction, and two is this direction over here going something someplace completely different. And here's what I'm talking about. The first, the direction that's going way off to the side is the current industry direction that's over focusing on high intensity training and training everybody like they're a professional athlete and making women do these exercises that are way too intense and so crazy and exotic exercises that women can't even perform these exercises properly. And they feel great at the time because the women are getting a great workout. They sweat and they feel like their muscles are working and they feel sore the next day. The challenge with these, this approach and the way our industry is going is that it's not sustainable. We're not helping, this approach in the industry is not helping our clients create sustainable strategies for using their body in an optimal manner meaning it's not going to last for a long time before these women have chronic issues. And many of these women already come to you and come to me as a chiropractic physician because they're experiencing chronic issues related to these high intensity training strategies. And it's not to say high intensity training is ineffective or inappropriate. However, we need a specific approach to help our female clients successfully and safely achieve their health and fitness goals without feeding into the patterns that directly contributing to chronic tightness, low back pain, hip problems, as well as the inability to perform at the levels they need to and or want to. Now, the direction that's going in the right direction is this is the best opportunity right now for you if you wanna differentiate yourself in the industry. And if you're watching our newsletter and part of our community, then you probably are already going this direction. However, the best direction right now in our industry is around this concept of medical fitness. Because here's a challenge that we're having with our healthcare industry. And you know there's lots of challenges. Obviously I know it because we work in that industry. I work in that industry. Is number one is we spend more money than anywhere else in the world on healthcare in this country. And we have some of the worst health problems in this country despite that one, nearly $1 trillion we spend, I should say probably not $1 trillion, but very close to a $1 trillion on our healthcare industry. And the health of our country is not really improving. In fact, our lifespan is actually, the only reason our lifespan is increasing is because we're getting better at keeping people alive. But the quality of people's lives isn't improving. People aren't living longer and healthier. They're living longer, but not healthier. So we wanna help create strategies for individuals to live longer and healthier. One of the ways to take advantage of this current healthcare crisis, because the other issue with our healthcare system is people are getting released from physical therapy, from chiropractic care, from different types of rehabilitation before they fully completed their rehab. For example, my mother-in-law was just, just had major knee surgery and she was released from care before she was fully recuperated from her situation and really fully got back to the quality of life because people are being released because of this mandate, the insurance, the insurance industry is mandating how doctors and therapists work with their clients and patients. One of the most effective directions you can take your career, if you haven't headed that way already, is in the medical fitness realm because so many women need and want your expertise. They have chronic issues. They're not getting complete rehab. They're not getting the strategies that they need to fully 
accomplish their health and fitness goals in a safe and effective manner, to restore range of motion, to develop their strength, to ve develop their endurance, to get back to the life that they once had and or to achieve their health and fitness goals because tightness, pain, and or weakness is keeping them from achieving those goals. So medical fitness is the number one direction to take your career. If you wanna differentiate yourself, help transform the lives of so many women that need and want your expertise, as well as make more money in this industry because as an expert, you can charge more money than all the other personal trainers and health coaches out there because you have a specific direction and a specific expertise and women that need you and want you will pay for that expertise. The second reason this information that we're gonna share with you in complete conditioning for the Female Core 2.0 program is so that you have an accurate lens, meaning that you have a lens to look at all the information that you have learned, are currently learning, and will learn in the future. Because what happens too frequently, and this happened to me early in my career, and it may be happening to you as well, is you go to conferences or you go online and you learn exercises and, 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 and the expert, the guru will say, hey, this is the best exercise for training the female core or strengthening the core or creating better flexibility. But what happens is you don't have a lens. To, if you don't have a lens to look at this information, then you just have to take the expert's word. And early on in my career, that's what I had to do because I had no lens. Now I have an accurate lens, and that's what we're gonna share with you in this program, so that you too have an accurate lens to look at all the information that we share with you in this program, and also that you will learn at any future conference. So then you can put it through your lens and say, is this information accurate? And number two, is this information appropriate for my female client that I'm working with? the baby boomer and senior population, the pre and post rehabilitation population, the pre and post natal population, those women that have had surgery and have chronic tightness and or discomfort and or weaknesses that aren't responding to, to, to traditional approaches. So that way you have an accurate lens to put all your information into and then you can distill the best information and say, hey, I'll take this information from here, I'll grab this information from here and use it and put it as part of your programs and then you're no longer worried about what all the experts say, you now become your own expert. The third reason that we're so excited to share this information with you is because this is the information that we use in our own clinic to change lives. Janice is gonna share with you later on today and she'll share with you in this resource her story of our client, Jenny, who was a failed low back surgery. She had two low back surgeries. She was a young, healthy female who had failed two low back surgeries. She'd gone through physical therapy and still had chronic low back pain and was ending up in bed for most, for quite a few days at a time or even weeks at a time and just couldn't do the things that she needed to and or wanted to. And she also had a fear. She had a fear that she wouldn't be able to get pregnant and more importantly, care for her child because she had trouble just standing up, walking, getting down on the floor. Janice used the concepts, the ex exact strategy we're gonna share with you in Complete Conditioning for the Female Core 2.0. She shared, she, she used these exact strategies and techniques with Jenny and now Jenny has a two-year-old, a healthy two-year-old. Jenny can, can get down on the floor with her child. She can pick up her child. She can play with her child. She can do all the things. She, she's actually, she said to me, uh, just the other day she came into our office. She travels between Florida and Chicago, our, our home base of Chicago, and she came in and said, I'm in the best shape of my life using these strategies that we'll share with you in Complete Conditioning for the Female Core 2.0 program. And also, Sarah Fisher, who contributed to this program as well, She's a certified integrative movement specialist as well. She will share with you her own personal story, how she used this information. Sarah, as a young dancer, young professional dancer, had obviously lots of injuries related to dance, and she also had a C-section with her first child in her mid-20s. And then she had a car accident, and compounding all these issues, she started to develop chronic tightness, discomfort, GI issues, headaches, migraines that she had never had prior to having this surgery and then this car accident. She used the exact information that we'll share with you, that she'll share with you in Complete Conditioning for the Female Core 2.0 product to help herself. And now she's gotten back to dance. She's been able to use this information not only to get her life back, to feel better, to move better, to have better range of motion, to, to really experience more 
vitality in her body, but she's actually using information to get back to dance, which she really, really loves to do. And that's what's so great about this information is that it can help change your clients' lives and help them get back to those activities that they really want to do. And for a lot of your female clients, it will help your clients get back to the things they really love to do. And it's appropriate for the clients that you work with, the general population client. Because a lot of the approaches that are being taught in, in our industry around training the female core, they're appropriate for high functioning individuals and those collegiate and professional athletes. Not very applicable to those women that you and I see in our office. Because I know you see clients just like we do, the women that come to you and they're looking for help for chronic low back tightness, or their hips always feel tight, or they feel like they have that, that little pooch or distended abdomen, and they've done tons of lower abdominal exercises and they still have that tiny pooch, or they feel like their, their abdomen is bloated and distended and they have to pull their abs in all the time. And they've gotten themselves into some of these strategies where they're tucking their hips and over squeezing their glutes and releasing their abdominals, or I should say tightening their abdominals. So in this program, we're gonna share with you the exact strategies we use with everyday individuals, especially the baby boomer and senior clients that come to you and will pay you for your expertise to help them accomplish their health and fitness goals. So what is this program all about? We're gonna share with you the integrative movement system, the proprietary system we created and teach as part of our certification course. And I see my good friend and colleague and certified integrated movement specialist Steven Schmolt is watching this. And Steven came through our first program and he works with tons of women that have these exact issues. And he successfully works with a lot of our clients that we refer over to Steven to continue on the work that we start in our clinic. So you're gonna learn the exact strategies that individuals like Steven uses with his clients and that we use with our own clients and patients so that you too can successfully help your clients accomplish their health and fitness goals. So you'll learn the exact assessments that we use with our clients. And I'll share with you the five easy assessments that you can do with your clients to quickly and easily evaluate core function in your female clients. That will take you into the corrective exercise strategies. The most effective corrective exercises for correcting, I should say, for helping your female clients create their most optimal and efficient posture and movement strategy. Because essentially what you're trying to look for in your assessments is your client's non-optimal and inefficient posture and movement habits. So as you take your client through the corrective exercise process and strategy that we'll share with you in this program, you are helping your female client adopt and develop a more optimal and efficient posture and movement strategy or posture and movement habits because that's ultimately what will help get her on that path to feeling better, moving better, and functioning better. And then we'll take you into phase three of the integrative movement system, and that's integration, where you integrate the concepts and the strategies you're helping your client develop during the corrective exercise process into the fundamental movement patterns. So squatting, lunging, bending, pushing, pulling, gait, balance, and carry. So those core patterns that most effectively will help your client feel better, move better, and ultimately work toward achieving her health and fitness goals. And that's really the magic in this approach that you're learning as you invest in complete female conditioning for the female core 2.0, is you're gonna learn exactly how to integrate these new habits from the corrective exercise strategy, these new habits that you're helping your female client adopt and develop into the fundamental movement patterns. You take these concepts and integrate them into those fundamental core patterns. And that's, like, as I said, that's really where the magic is. That's how you help your clients move from where they are right now, so if they have tightness and or discomfort and just feel weak and don't have endurance, and take them for the, from where they are to where they want to go. So you su successfully help them create those strategies that are sustainable, that will help them accomplish their health and fitness goals, whether they just wanna feel better, whether they wanna move better, and even those clients that wanna look better, they will look better. And we hear from clients all the time that say, hey, you know what, I actually feel and look thinner. I haven't lost any weight because they're actually using their core muscles in a more efficient manner. And we'll also share with you when Things like, when is it appropriate to brace? And when is it appropriate to stop having your clients brace? And when is over bracing actually a problem? We'll share with you the most effective corrective exercises and functional exercise progressions. 
So that way you're teaching your client the most effective exercises to help them accomplish their goals. We'll share with you also those exercises that your clients maybe need to stop doing because they're actually contributing to low back and or hip issues. For example, many of our clients are doing hip thrusters and they're actually driving themselves right into hip and low back problems by using the strategy that's taught commonly in hip thruster type activities. So we're gonna show you how to modify that pattern so the pattern actually creates more optimal range of motion, strength, stability, and decreases the chronic tightness and issues that performing this pattern incorrectly actually creates. So what all do you get as part of your investment in this program? You will get the quick start guide. You know, I have my quick start guide right here. So I actually printed this out. This whole program is entirely online, but I actually printed this out because I love to read information. So you get the quick start guide and you'll start here with this quick start guide because this quick start guide is basically an outline of what the entire complete conditioning for the female core 2.0 program is all about. So you read through this and it's a very quick, easy read. It's basically a synopsis of what the program is about. So you know exactly where to start and how this program is set up. Then you'll move into a couple really cool bonuses because we create these bonus bonus, these five bonuses specifically so that you can get started right away. And the first bonus is seven short videos, three to eight minutes long that cover the seven principles of training the female core. And this is basically the foundation, it sets the foundation for how you're going to work with your female clients after you view this program. Because from there, your next bonus, bonus number two, is the seven key corrective exercises. And I'll take you through the exact corrective exercises that we use with our own female clients, that Janice took her client Jenny through, that Sarah went through herself, the most common exercises we use with our female clients to help them develop a more optimal and efficient core stabilization strategy. So we'll show you very quickly and easily how you can use corrective exercise to create a more optimal and efficient strategy in your female clients. So that way you could watch this today as soon as you purchase this on your lunch break. The videos are, are that quick and short and right to the point that you can start using the information in your afternoon sessions with your female clients. The third bonus is we'll share with you the seven patterns that you either need to modify and or avoid. Because one of the concepts we teach as part of the Integrative Movement Specialist Certification Program is that for many of your female clients, it's about teaching them what to do. However, for many of your clients that struggle with chronic tightness, discomfort, and or the inability to, to perform at the levels they need to or want to, it's about stopping them from doing the things, the strategies, the techniques, the cues, the bracing that they're doing that are directly contributing to their issues. So I'll share with you the seven things that you need to modify, or I should say the seven patterns and strategies you need to modify in your female clients so they stop contributing to chronic tightness of their low back and their hips. So they stop gripping and inhibit their ability to create anterior pelvic tilt. So they start using exercises more effectively. So I'll share with you the exact exercises to use as well as the exercises you need to avoid and or modify for your female clients. Your next bonus is program design. So I created a program design manual so that way you will see exactly how to create successful programs for your female clients and how we use this information and how you too can plug it right into the programs that you're using with your female clients that you're already using with success so you can use these strategies right away and really help transform your female clients so they have a better functioning core and ultimately can get back to the things they need to, want to, and or love to do. And I didn't even put this in the on the website that we have two additional bonuses. And there's, there's two webinars. The first webinar is by Janice and Sarah. Janice and Sarah also contribute, contributed to this product, this program, and they'll be on later on today answering some frequently asked questions around training the female core. But the first webinar, Janice and Sarah will discuss the female cycle and how training the female core is different than training the male core and how the cycle impacts how your clients will activate and how they'll function when they're going through their cycle. So they'll discuss the exact strategies that they that they take their female clients through to address their core around the time of the cycle because that's oftentimes what we found with our female clients, that's often the time where clients will get into issues. It's when they're starting to release all those hormones 
around the time of their cycle and they're starting to get a little more hypermobile and the things that you can do with your client to modify and adapt their programs during that time of their cycle. The second webinar is a webinar that I'll, I will take you through once you've worked through the material, so a couple weeks down the road from now, after you've invested in and actually read and watched the videos, I'll take you through a webinar on the progressions. How do we progress our clients? Because one of the concepts I'll share with you in this program that you'll notice very specifically as you work your way through this program is that when we first start training the female core, it's all about controlling, aligning and controlling the thoracopelvic cylinder and really helping your client develop her most optimal strategy for controlling sagittal plane motion. Now, I just went to a workshop. I was teaching at a workshop where there's a lot of professional coaches that, that work with professional athletes and high functioning individuals. And everybody's talking about, you gotta move through the frontal plane, you gotta move through the transverse plane. And one of the strategies that I discussed when I got up there to talk about the, the core and the hips is that you have to get really, really good and specific about teaching your female clients to control sagittal plane motion first. Because what we found and what we'll share with you in this program is that when you help your female clients develop an optimal strategy for controlling, aligning and controlling her thoracopelvic cylinder, so her core, and you teach her how to develop sagittal plane stabilization through the exercises that we're taking you through, you will actually help them improve function in the frontal and transverse planes. You'll increase range of motion without doing tons of stretching or tons of myofascial release because that's ultimately why your clients are not, or why releasing chiropractic adjustments, manual therapy, self myofascial release, that's why those strategies don't last because clients are stretching, mobilizing, releasing, and then they're going right back to the same strategies that caused the problems in the first place. So they say, oh, that corrective exercise didn't work. That chiropractor didn't help me. That physical therapist, you know, I tried that, it, it didn't work because they're not changing their strategy and they're trying to do or work through ranges of motion and or exercises patterns that are too high level for them or too dynamic for them to, to control. So when you do an excellent job of helping your client create her most optimal and efficient strategy and control sagittal plane motion first, you really set her up for success. And that's why we're so excited to have you join us in this program and work through the progressions that we'll share with you in this program. So in recap, you're going to receive the six hours of modules of the Complete Conditioning for the Female Core 2.0 program. You'll learn about how to assess your client, how to create and use corrective exercise to help your client develop a more optimal and efficient strategy, and you'll learn how to integrate this information into the fundamental movement patterns that best train the core in a safe and effective manner. You'll also discover how to integrate the psoas and glutes. So in the module four, so there's four modules, module four is all about integrating the psoas and glutes so your clients have better functioning hips in the process as well. Because a lot of hip exercises that we'll talk about in this program actually are contributing, the way clients are using this, this or these exercises, are actually contributing to your client's issues, especially when your clients are doing bird dog exercises or hip thruster exercises as we discussed previously, and common patterns like deadlifts. So we'll show you how to modify these exercises. We'll share with you the most effective corrective exercises and how to integrate the fundamental squatting, lunging, bending, hip hinging, deadlifting type patterns so that your client has improved function of her glutes and psoas in addition to a more optimal functioning core. And then we'll throw in these five bonuses. You'll get the quick action guide to give you an outline of the course. That's actually not a bonus, that's actually part of the program, but we'll give you the, we'll send you the seven videos, the key principles for training the female core so that you understand the entire program that you'll be learning as you watch through the, as you work your way through the modules. You'll get the seven key corrective exercises so you can start to use this information right away. As I said, you could watch this information this afternoon and then use the information in your afternoon session and start to see the changes in your clients already. You'll get the seven strategies that you need to avoid with your clients the strategies and or exercises you need to avoid with your female clients, especially your clients that have chronic tightness, pain, and or the inability to perform at the level she needs to and or wants to. So that way, as I mentioned, some of your female clients, that's what they need. That's the information they actually need. Like one woman came up to us at a seminar and she said, last year when you came to the workshop, you taught us to stop gripping our abs. I stopped gripping my abs 
my low back pain went away. So again, it's about stopping some of these strategies that your female clients are doing to help put them on the path to success. And I forgot to mention the one bonus, the five assessments, because during your assessments, very easy assessments that you can do with all your clients, you want to pick up and identify your clients' non-optimal and inefficient habits, because that's what the corrective exercises are designed to do, help your clients create more optimal and efficient habits. And then finally, you'll get the program design guide, how to put this information together into the programs that you're already using with success. And then you get the two free bonuses, so that's actually seven bonuses, the bonus webinar with Janice and Sarah, where they'll talk about the female cycle, because a lot of your female clients will experience issues around their cycle, and then the bonus webinar with me after you work through the program for a couple weeks, and it will come together to recap the most important points, to answer your questions, and also to show you the progressions. How do we start to train our clients in different planes of motion and train them more dynamically? So you get the entire complete female core conditioning 2.0 on a special release that we're doing this weekend. For just $97, you get this entire program. You get over the six hours of content, materials that you can use and develop yourself into an expert and help more of your female clients to really help them transform how they feel, how they move, and ultimately how they accomplish their goals. And you get the bonuses, the five bonuses plus the two bonus webinars. Well over $500 worth of value. You get it this weekend. We're offering it for a limited time offer for $97. This really is the time if you're looking to differentiate yourself, which I know you are, which is why you're part of our community, so that you can be on the forefront of where our industry is going, not over here where there's a lot of issues and a lot of the, the approaches are actually contributing to the problem our female clients are having. So invest now in yourself, in your clients. Transform the lives of your female clients because there's so many women, your, your clients that you're currently working with, and so many more women that want, need, and will pay you for your expertise. This is Dr. Evan Osar. I look forward to seeing you in the program from sharing this information. And also, we want to hear back from your success. How have you used this information? And I want, we want to hear your client testimonials. And also, have your clients video testimonials for you so that you can put them on your website because your clients will change when you help them use this information, when you institute this information and put it into their programs. You're going to see changes that you really didn't think were possible. And that's the value, the importance of this information. And that's why we're so excited to bring you this information and have you join us in this program. So this is Dr. Evan Osar for the Institute for Integrative Health and Fitness Education and co-creator of the Complete Conditioning for the Female Core 2.0. I look forward to seeing you inside the program.